are bu- 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 buck. It's the new Canadian music video releases. It's your boy Friday Ricky Dread, aka Media Rick, and we're back with a list of new hot music videos. Now, before I start this video here, I need you to please, please subscribe to our YouTube channel, hit that subscription button below, as well as the notification bell next to it so you know when we're dropping new videos. Leave your comments below so you'll, you know, to let us know how we're doing with the content, what new content that you want to see from the We Love Hip Hop Network work as well as six views and six views uncut and we got a lot of videos that are dropping for you every single day sometimes two three or four times a day so make sure to subscribe now this video that you're going to be seeing right here is going to be a list of all the new canadian music videos that have dropped within the last seven days all 500 views and up and we need you the people to decide who is going to be the top six music videos in canada this week all right so you can do that by Letting us know in the comments below, comment gang strong, who is your favorite rapper on the list or what is your favorite song on this list. We'll be able to tabulate all your votes and on Thursday morning on the World's Most Smoked Out podcast, we'll be announcing the votes and then you'll be able to catch it whether you listen to it in the audio or check it out in a video that we drop every single Saturday. All right, so we need your help so we'll be able to decide who is going to be the number one video in Canada. Comment gang scrum. Now at the end of this video, at the end of this video right here, I'm going to be giving you a breakdown of rappers wearing ski masks through the history of hip hop from the first rappers, notable rappers who were wearing ski masks or wearing any kind of mask or any kind of face coverings to where we are now with the UK rappers like M. Huncho, you know, guys like r and R, oh, representing Atlanta and different rappers in the game who have been able to get success or mainstream success or some kind of success to a degree while still having their face covered. So you're gonna to wanna to stay tuned to the end of the video to get some of that content, but no more long talking. Let's get to these music videos. New Canadian music video releases. Let's go. Shirek's run another one. Me Gucci linen, mahogany all on my casket. This shit is not just for the fashion. Hop up the coop and I blast it. Addicted to money and trapping, I gotta have it. Keep my toes snare. Toes stop me in the money. Gang with me, let the army. I'm Vitus, try and bite us. Downs beside us, cause our arms tight. My God. Real wonderful nigga. But it's up, up, realist. Out here, I always keep it a buck, buck. Grew up. They dictate the rock and I think straight with this propaganda These rappers today draw me fucking bananas Eating my food plate on top of the food chain When I'm touring, uh, uh, Ziggy Doing my dance, no jiggy I stop off his head, no biggie I can never let it go I can never let this game down I can never let it go and roll through the six with a Watch out my jewelry on frost You know my heart been cold But you know I've been colder And they selling some dreams for But I don't do no coca, I'm a heavy smoker Shorty made me do it, wasn't tryna choke her Myself independent, making hits almost every recession. Bro, I'm Gucci, I'm on Christian. Just make me unaware. Would you ride for me if I was facing years? Pop smoke, but I clear the room. Hundred round for your bulletproof. Headshot when we coming through. Man down, it ain't nothing new. Run the laps, I own the race. I bought the shoe, y'all just tie my lace. Uh, I got an addiction to fast money. Overdose and I'm okay. A lot of gas in the car, and it's going super fast. And if it's 12, I'm gonna ask you. Yeah, she likes the way 
when you cashing a check Got my ten bows on and my foot's on your necks I don't need no new friends, I ain't playing on the game Oh, where the sky be, try me Got three guns, five G's Streets of tech, not a jet, you can't fly me All right, so let's get to our industry tips. And as promised, I'm not gonna be giving industry tips this week. However, it's gonna be sort of an industry tip in a way. We're gonna be talking about rappers who have been wearing ski masks from the beginning to where we are right now, or any kind of masks covering their faces. Now, this was prompted by a rant that I had um, up on the We Love Hip Hop Network Instagram Live. Um, you know, I was talking to a few rappers, we were having a, you know, I was getting a few rappers to jump on the live and throw their bars down. And you know, a couple of people jumped on with their masks on and it got me to thinking and I asked somebody, why do all you guys always cover your faces? Because it's gonna be way harder for you to be popular or to get the popular that you're trying to gain. Okay, before we start, family. Log on. Let me ask you a question. Log on. Okay, that I always want to ask a lot of Toronto rappers that we see y'all music videos. Why yeah. do you guys always cover your fucking faces? More times? I have a pending case right now. Say less. Say less. Let's go. Let's get to the music. You know what I mean? I just, I, 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 I thought it was more complicated than that or whatever, but if it's not, then like, it wasn't even. It wasn't even like some hard body it was like public masturbation. But yo, let's get into this. <laughs> let's go. Now, um, with that being said, I started looking through people through history who have been wearing masks in their career, whether it's been the beginning of their career or some at some point in their career and the success that they've attained. So. Just to break it down a little bit, now the ski mask through history has been the sign of the jack boy, okay? The guy who's gonna run up in your spot, take all these things, you know what I'm saying? For uh, for the people who are out there on the street, I don't wanna say too, too much, and I don't wanna get the video demonetized, but it's always been the sign of the jack boy, okay? Back, back in the days, they were used like in bank robberies. A lot of people used to see them in the movies and stuff like that, where bank robbers would put on the ski mask and go run into place, right? So when it came to hip hop and you know, the the, the badassery and you know the street element that comes with hip hop the ski mask became something that was very synonymous with a lot of rappers when they wanted to show their their jack boy side right now from the first time i could remember as a hip hop head in history of seeing any rapper who had his face covered would be back in 1993 with the ghost face killer okay now on the Enter the 36 Chambers album, the first time that I seen the video for the mystery of chess boxing, that's when Ghostface Killer had the white stocking over his face. Um, you know, he had like a, a, a do-rag I think he had on. You know, I'll, I'll, show, I'll throw a clip on the, on the screen for y'all to see. But he had his face covered and it was said that during those times that he was dealing with a lot of cases. Apparently he, he or allegedly he was on the run or on, on those times. Um, and this is the first Wu-Tang album. So he was just coming right off of the street into the rap game. So I don't know all um, all the truthfulness to all these folklores. Um, you know, that was the first time that I was ever able to see somebody on camera, on a music video, who was wearing a, uh, some kind of something covering their face in a video, who also went on to become somebody who's super popular. So big up to the ghost face killer. Um, next I can remember would be MF Doom. Okay, MF Doom was born in the UK. He grew up in the USA between Long Beach, California and New York City. And his first rap name was Zeb Love X. Okay, who was part of the group KMD, which to me was introduced by the white rap group back in the days, Third Base. Okay, now MF Doom's mask was similar to the Marvel comic, um, comic book character, Dr. Doom. Um, which was depicted on his first album, or the first time he depicted on the album was in 1999 on Operation Doomsday, all right? Um, through the years, MF Doom has gone on to be popularized through wearing that mask all the time. And it has been rumored that there's been concerts that MF Doom has done where he didn't even show up himself and he had somebody else standing in for him wearing the mask to go through the concert.
concert for him and collect the bag right so in the end of the day shout out to mf doom one of the first people i could realize through history who was wearing a mask um through his rap career now the next person i can remember um when it comes to wearing ski masks it started going a little bit later on in time and that would be young buck okay formerly of g unit um young buck had his first album straight out of cashville in 2004 and that's where he started wearing a lot of ski masks in the in the promo shots and the, like a lot of promo build um to build the album the album and build his image up um he was known as the cleanup man um and a lot of different nicknames that he had but in his heyday young buck was known to wear a lot of ski masks in his photo shoots and was known for the guy wearing ski masks okay representing nashville tennessee now we can't talk about ski masks and rappers who were wearing ski masks without talking about plies okay now plies represent in florida he came out back in the days he was like a rapper from the mid 2000s for the people out there from the old school crowd y'all know exactly who plies is you know bust it baby that guy right there okay now plies dropped his first album in 2007 via slip and slide records okay and that was the, call, the album called the realist testament but when he dropped his second album in 2008 definition of real is where he had the ski mask on the cover of the album and then from there plies took the ski mask game to the next level even having a ski mask pendant multiple ski masks pendant if you all remember okay so big up the plies somebody who really took the ski mask game to the next next level now as time has gone, gone forward a, a lot of rappers um, have done ski masks that haven't been as popular over the years there has been a definitely in definitely definitely has ri risen and there has been a boost in, in rappers wearing ski masks with the insurgent of the UK drill scene and a lot of rappers out of the UK started popping up wearing masks in their videos okay shout out to guys like Meeks shout out to 67 you know the member in 67 LD who has that big metal masks on his face you know kind of paying homage I think to MF Doom but he could be doing his own thing as well and there's a lot of rappers M Huncho out there guys who have millions and millions and millions of views on their YouTube videos and they have never shown their face is on camera um there also is the group r and r that is representing atlanta who just started coming out with some songs that have been taken you know getting a lot of traction and that guy or that group right there has been wearing their whole group is wearing ski masks the lead singer wears a, wears a ski mask and we have yet to see what they look like okay now what does that mean for toronto I need you, the people, to let me know what Toronto rapper has been able to take it to the next level, okay? Because with the exception of the new rappers that have come out now that are able to establish millions of views on their YouTube, they still have their issues like the group 6-7, you know, they have videos that have been taken off of YouTube by the UK police or the UK authorities, you know, they have problems doing shows, their shows get raided, um, a lot of UK rappers are on the run or, you know, are dealing with a lot of legal issues while they're maintaining or gaining popularity on YouTube, okay? However, there still is a ceiling, but then when you got guys like r, &R who are blowing up, when this whole pandemic is done, will r, &R be, be able to go out there and do shows or are, is he dealing with a case as well, okay? I know with a lot of the Toronto rappers out there, there's a few notable ones. Shout out to T Jin, who I seen for through the years dropping videos that have accumulated tens of thousands, some in the hundreds of thousands of views, you know, who's down with um, 3M French and the whole CLE and not Cleveland crew. You know what I'm saying? He hasn't shown his face in videos and he's been able to accumulate a lot of popularity in the scene out here. However, he, you know, as far as the one of the most popular rappers in the scene, we gotta be honest, he's not the most popular rapper in the scene and a lot of the different ski mask guys out here are not the most popular rappers, even though they get traction on their videos. So my question to you as the audience is, can a Toronto rapper blow up by only wearing a ski mask or some kind of face covering, Bella Clava, whatever it is, through their whole career and never showing their face? Let me know in the audience, um, let me know in the comments below. Also, let me know what Toronto rappers are burning up the scene right now that you never get to see their faces, okay? Let's talk about it in the comments below. Comment gang strong. And also, let me know who you think should be the top 
video in Canada this week, all right, or the top six videos in Canada this week. Let me know in the montage that we showed from the montage that we showed earlier, who are your favorite rappers or what is your favorite song on the list. And as said before, we will be announcing it on Thursday morning on the world's most smoked out podcast. Make sure to follow me on all my social media platforms at Friday Ricky Dread, that's D R E D, as well as make sure to hit up our website, we love hip hop.ca, and make sure to follow us on Instagram, we love hip hop network. It's your boy Friday Ricky Dread, aka Media Rick, and I'm out. <laughs>